Well, hi guys, welcome back to another grocery haul. This is a very small one. I needed to just pick up a few things at Walmart and threw a few extra things in the cart per usual. So let me just jump in here. Nothing too terribly exciting, but I'll just start down here. Uh, we got several Powerades and Gatorade varieties. It's nice for when you're working outside to have something refreshing with some good electrolytes and things in there to help you feel good while you're in the heat. Picked up these Kool-Aid bursts. This is for our little grandsons. They think it is such a treat to go in the barn refrigerator and get out a little juice. So Pops says keep these in the barn fridge for the little boys and so that's fun to have in there for them. Picked up some Almond Breeze. Let's go up here for our fruit and veggies. Just a few bananas. This premium romaine. That's my favorite from Walmart. I got a smaller bag this time because we do have good lettuce coming out of our garden right now and spinach. So this is just kind of to supplement. A head of garlic, a cucumber. Our, our cucumber plant just, um, just didn't make it this year so no cucumbers out of the garden. Picked up some strawberries, blueberries, and raspberries. Snacked on those on the way home from the grocery store. James did. Picked up some turkey smoked sausage and I thought we would give this a try as well. This Genio turkey sausage. It's a breakfast style sausage. Um, I just want to see what this is like. We have some salami and Eckridge garlic bologna from the deli. Moving on back we have two blocks of the low fat cream cheese. We have a cottage cheese, a sour cream, a big tub of Greek yogurt, and then some smaller little cups of yogurt, two blueberry, two of the toasted vanilla uh, coconut, and then one of the peach. In the back there we picked up the Foster Farms corn dogs. I love this particular brand. They're chicken, Frank's, and it's a real, it says a honey crunchy batter and that is the perfect way to describe it. They're pretty low in fat and calories and they're really good. So that's the brand I buy most often. Um, almost out of chocolate syrup. We keep that in the fridge for chocolate milk. Self-rising flour, I was almost out of that. And a package of buttermilk waffles. This is for some chicken and waffles. I'm making for a quick addition to breakfast at church. We're having for our fellowship meal. Uh, breakfast is the theme. I have a box of the ready-made pie crust. That's my favorite way to do pie crust. I don't make them from scratch very often. So I usually buy those and I'm going to make a couple zucchini pies. I needed a package of butter. And I went for this almond bark and a couple other things. I'm going to make like a cereal, um, sweet and salty um, munch mix type um, dessert. And so I went for the bark and for these little mini M&Ms. And then I'm going to serve them out of these little paper sacks. There's 16 in this package. They will stand on their own once they're open. So I thought I'm just going to fill these sacks about three-fourths of the way full with a little snack mix. And that'll be a fun addition at our fellowship meal as well. Um, James thought we'd give these tr a try. They're for him. Um, spicy jalapeno bean and cheese chimichangas. Um, every now and then he likes to just have something like this that he can grab out for a quick snack or breakfast or just whenever the mood strikes. I got these little mini marshmallows. Well these are the fun marshmallows. They're flower shaped. I keep these for our little grandsons because they really like those as a treat. And this is the first time to get the flower shaped. I had the dinosaurs before and I can't find those anymore. Okay my favorite bread is the nutty oat and then I found some markdown bread. This was 50 cents and it is an everything Italian. So for 50 cents, I thought that would be great. I'll probably stick this in the freezer to whenever I need it. And then this loaf was 60 cents and it is so soft. I love it when they bake too much bread and then mark it down. For non-food, we needed another hairspray. We needed this um, Arm, and Ham Arm and Hammer Essentials. It's the paraben and aluminum free deodorant. James has been trying that for a while and he's liking that. I showed you these paper, paper sacks already 
And then the Clear American, I got the Cherry Limeade this time. We have had this and we liked that flavor as well. So that's it guys. Nothing real spectacular here, but blessed to get to buy some more food to go in the pantry and the refrigerator. Always grateful and thankful for those things in life that we are blessed with and I hope you feel the same. Thanks for watching this video. If you'd like to give it a thumbs up, if you haven't subscribed, I'd love to have you around here and I'll see you the next time. Take care.